Hello guys, this is Sirwan. Today I'm going to show you what's new on iOS 5.1 in both iPad and iPhone 4S. To be sure that I'm on the iOS 5.1, I'll show you the version of my iPad here. Yeah. Yeah. We are going to start our tutorial with the camera application. With iOS 5.5.1, you noted that the camera application completely redesigned it. Here, the shutter button was coming to next to the home button here, and this is the option menu to enable grid on iPad 2 which in iOS 5.1 the option menu located here and the same as swapping camera and changing to video mode or photography mode also we noticed that the camera sh shutter button completely redesigned it as well as the video recording And we try to take some photos actually. Now with iOS 5.1, you are able to delete photos in photo stream, which you can you aren't able to do to do to delete photos in previous version actually. Now we are on photo stream. Mm, here delete and it will delete uh, and it will the photo when you delete the photo on iPad or iPhone or iPad touch the photo automatic automatically deleted on the both iPhone and iPad or iPad touch we can make a here also when you open Safari actually wait sorry I will have to close the tabs yeah you noticed that the text was added to the search bar and it's go to the address which you weren't able to see, you didn't able to see this in the previous version actually and I think there's a lot of feature on iPad too. There's some um, minor feature here, but it's no matter to be no or no. Now we are talking about iPhone 4s actually. Uh, this is my iPhone 4s. No. Yeah. Now. In the the camera icon every time we shown on the lock screen and here you, you can see this two line under the camera and two line up the camera here you can take photos and the face detection improvement on this version Oh, flash. I don't like flash. I don't like flash. Okay. Also, the same as the Safari, go to the address added to the iPhone 4S. And with, with the AT&T network, you are able to use 4G network on iPhone 4S. And also, you are able to on, turn on or off 3G network on your iPhone. But because I'm on, on 3 network, I'm not, not able to do this because Siri don't have GPRS connection in UK in the UK.
also the new language was added to iOS 5.1 and it's a Japanese Japanese language added to Siri actually what it is come on talk <laughs> and also there's some new features was it like baseband update carrier updates for AT&T and maybe they, uh, they were going to fix the battery but it's the same for me than like the previous versions and also genius now available with iTunes March as well as other publications also there's some bug fixes here and hopefully iOS 5.1 is in release on the iPad or on the new the new iPad we can see the iPad 3 and also with iOS 5.1 uh, there are some new improving here like improving on assistive touch and improve, improve location service as I tell you camera face detection now highlights all detected face and that's one of the greatest feature for photographer actually and the la the one the one new feature which is so so amazing in this app store download limit of a 3G network now increases from 20 megabyte to 550 megabyte and that's a good news for people who are on this region network um, now also I will put all the features all the features on my info information bar on the video tutorial here. Thank you for watching and sorry for my bad English and please if you noticed that my video is useful for you please subscribe and follow me on Twitter at Sirwanjn and please follow me on Facebook Sirwanjn. Thank you for watching.